And right now, new details on the search for a driver who crashed into a house then ran from the scene. Tonight, a family is looking for a new place to live because of that crash. CBS 4's Joe Murray is live for us in Pompano Beach with the story. Joan? Elliot, this was a bad wreck. When the family got up this morning, they had a house. So take a look now. It is boarded up, and they are forced to find a new place to live. The driver of the blue Saturn sports car slammed through the front entry of this Northwest Second Terrace home and didn't stop, nearly hitting the back wall. He came straight down 17th at a high rate of speed and just smashed into the house, um, just totaling this house, basically. Everything is in pieces. Fire rescue said thankfully an infant and his caretaker were in another room. All the time we heard was a bam. Sally Shivers lives next door and ran outside to see this. It's not nice. Mm -hmm. Anybody could have got killed in there. The driver ran away, but Jonathan DeBreus and others tried to stop the passenger. And when we saw everyone was just astonished, we just made sure that he, the other guy didn't get away, and we just stayed with the family. Family members in shock over their shattered belongings sifted through what was left, trying to salvage what they could. After the car was towed, a building inspector said the damage is too severe. The family cannot stay here. The landlord is putting them up in a hotel while the search goes on for the driver. Residents in the neighborhood have said that they frequently see this car driving recklessly through the neighborhood. Um, so obviously it's, it's a local um, car or local individuals riding the car, but um, they obviously bailed out of the car and ran. That passenger was not seriously hurt. If you know the driver, give Broward Sheriff's Office a call. In Pompano Beach tonight, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.